<laughs> Happy Thursday, which is weird because I never get to say that. Thursday streaming. I hope everyone's week is going well. Hello, J Ghost. Hello, J Man. Hello, Raymond. <laughs> Welcome on in. I'm excited to get started. I will most likely be a little slow because I haven't played um, Pokemon in a while. A hot minute, you know? So I don't really know where I am. I don't know what Pokemon are in my party. <laughs> um, but we'll try to figure it out. <laughs> You're doing the final trial. Cool, cool, cool. Ah. 
Oh, that's nice. That's nice that it's way less dialogue. I felt like there was a lot of talking and like very little story, which is weird. <laughs> it was just like, hey, go on this random task. So I'm excited though. I feel like this one seems like it's a lot more expansive. I am really excited to see the starters. That's like probably what I'm most excited for and to get new abilities for my Koridon. That's it. They drop you in the terrarium. Cool, cool, cool. Well, we might just get straight into it, you know? Um, let me pause this. I'm gonna have to shift some things around here. Okay. I think this is good volume. Yeah, whatever. Um, if my Elgato gets fucky, I will just take the sound off. <laughs> but I want to try to keep it on today. So we'll see how things go. <gasps> Sorry. Sorry if I spoiled it. I just, I know when they first dropped the DLC announcements, they said that you would be able to like do more flying mechanics and i think it's kind of shown you know they in the trailer if you watched it there's like those games where you can go through hoops and shit this is clavel do i have the pleasure of speaking with miss marissa hey, yep that's me <laughs> Okay, cool. Cool. But are you going to get into it this weekend, J Ghost? My, my, it certainly does. This old heart, good to be greeted with such a lively response. Now, if I could take but a moment of your time, there is something we must discuss. Miss Marissa, you're about to be presented with an exceptional opportunity. You already know of the Unova's region, uh, Blueberry Academy. Of course, I'm so smart. Okay, blah, blah, blah. He told me he would be delighted to host you. A fine chance for you to learn even more about the world. I was a bit surprised Blueberry's director would specify you by name. Would you feel ready to respond to his offer? I ask you to come by my office so we can discuss the specifics together. Okay. We'll just go. Where am I? I'm confused. Like, because I feel like last time I shut off my game, I was not in this region. God. I think my, my Joy-Con has drift on it. Rob, hello! Oh my gosh, it's been so long. It's good to see you. Welcome back. Um, I completed it for mine. Yeah, I didn't complete it for, I didn't get the Violet exclusives yet, but I have them. <laughs> I have them, I just need to trade them. But I've just been so lazy. Okay. Thanks, J-Ghost. I should be able to take care of it, so no worries. I'm just like so lazy. I hardly play my Switch anymore, which is kind of sad. Question mark, question mark, question mark. <laughs> He's like cross-eyed. Why'd they make him like that? Who do we have here? I know I've seen your face before. Who were you again? <laughs> Since online trades are nearly dead. That's nice. So you're, you have all of it for the base game or for the first DLC too? Well then, now that you're here, let's get going. Wait, 
Wait just a moment, Director Serrano. <laughs> or is it Cry? C Serrano. Oh, hello there, Veli. Uh, you're lively as always. Didn't realize you were here. Of course I'm here. I'm the director of this academy. Okay. And do address me more properly while students are present, would you? <laughs> The silly old men. What are you gonna do? Uh, what's it matter? This is a student, right? Well, yes, but uh, you must be terribly confused. Blueberry Academy. Okay, as I mentioned on the phone, he's interested in accepting you as an exchange student. <laughs> okay, makes me suspect that you indeed failed to clarify that point. <laughs> Why did you request Miss Marissa specifically to take part in your exchange program? His cross-eyed eyes are sending me. Excellent question, Veli. It's very simple. You see the reason is? Hmm, why did I put in that request? Oh, that's right. The school trip to Kitakami. Marissa met some of my students there, didn't she? <laughs> yes, one of them was named Carmine. I miss Carmine. She's the one who recommended you. Bactrian! What's good? Um, I've got a good feeling about you. Oh ho! <laughs> oh ho! <laughs> It's just really silly, like he just looks like when he's looking at me. <laughs> I'd love you to visit my school. Would you, you would be a breath of fresh air, so to speak. Oh my God, uh, I can be your Pokemon bestie. You don't even have to ask. Oh my gosh, I'm good, but dude. Okay, so I went to physical therapy and I've been going for the past like three weeks. I think this is like my third week of going. And last week I canceled my second appointment because I thought I was going to the movie that night and I was horribly mistaken. And so I didn't do any other physical therapy outside of like my appointments, which is probably my bad. But on Tuesday I went back and then they just like drilled me like the whole time. That sounds fucked. They they like strength trained me the whole time. And before I was doing like relatively easier mobility style movements. And so it like fucked me up, dude. So I've been like really sore and I'm supposed to go back tonight and I'm gonna just cry. If they tell me to do like one thing, I'm gonna just cry. So that's how I am. How are you? <laughs> Oh my God, Jagos. Okay, I wanna go, let's go. I'm gonna go with the old man. <laughs> Are you ready to kick off your studies abroad? Yes. Let's go. Red Shade, hi. How are you this Thursday? It's weird saying Thursday. Because you have, oh shit. Hmm, I mean, I can check again afterwards too, but maybe target would be best. I'm glad to hear it, Red Shade. Getting hammered is better than getting drilled. Like drinking? <laughs> Oh my gosh, Red Shade, the movie was incredible. And I didn't know anything about their story until, sorry, we're trying to figure out dinner right now. I didn't know anything about their story until the movie was announced at like the beginning of this year. So then Nathan kind of gave me the rundown. And I was just like, holy shit, but my husband is a wrestler. So I feel like if you're in any kind of capacity, Fighting, wrestling, body to body, shit. 
you probably know these people's stories. And, um, yeah, the movie was just really, really good. It, it had, like, every emotion. The actors were great. The, the cinematography and the pacing were, like, just amazing. It, it made it for me. We're gonna do a video tonight. <laughs> a little recording. I can't believe that their academy is in the middle of the fucking ocean. Like, has anyone addressed that yet? Like, who decided? <laughs> who said? Okay, this is the entrance of the school itself. It's mostly underwater. Did you notice? Balls. Look how blue this place is. I can't tell you how long I spent picking the perfect blueberry color. What film? It's called The Iron Claw, Raymond. Dude, really? Some Illuminati shit. More like underwaddy shit. <laughs> ah! I fucking hate it. Okay. I want to know, I don't, I want to know why he knows him, the other director. Sorry, my head's probably blocking that one. Really? That's what you're curious about? Well, it's very simple, you see. It's, uh... <gasps> oh, they got to know each other through their postgraduate work at the same university. Or at least that's what I've heard. Yes, right, exactly. Took the words right out of my mouth. Do you think they're former lovers? Always on point, aren't you, Lacey? Oh no, it was nothing. Do we have a guest today? We do, Marissa's here as a part of the exchange program. Make her feel welcome. Hold on, this is the exchange student from <laughs> Baldia region. Try to say exchange, exchange student five times fast, okay? I suppose I didn't introduce myself, did I? I'm Lacey, I'm one of the second year students here. You must be, really be something special. It's rare for director Cyrano uh, to, re to remember the name of a new student. Just call me out, why don't you? I've got an idea, why don't you explain how things work around here? <laughs> he just doesn't wanna do his job. That's true, but I imagine there must be someone more suitable than me. Please don't take it like, yeah. It, it's not that I don't want to show you around or anything. Um, he has this bad habit of pushing his duties onto me. You see, I mean, classic, I'm gonna just say it, classic men just fucking making their women coworkers do everything. Really letting me have it today, aren't you? <laughs> that said, this might be my chance to get to know the new students everyone's talking about uh, before anyone else can. I like your hair clip. It's actually really cute. I will take on this task. I think he is just a Gen Z. Isn't that younger than me? Nathan's trying to convince me that I am Gen Z and I can't stand for that. Alex, hi. At our school, the exchange student. Oh, she's talking shit already. You don't look that strong. Yeah, talking shit already. This DLC is so fun. <laughs> it's just like real life. It's just like going outside. <laughs> into real life people just say you don't look that strong no matter how many pokeballs i have it's never enough you should do some barbecues once you've earned the barbie points <laughs> you can buy some nice pokeballs <sighs> oh shit i didn't want to talk to the eggs i wanted to talk to the egg Master and stretch. Oh, he's not really gonna talk. I don't know. He gave me a calendar. He said the year I'm born means I'm a Gen Z. And I said, that's so wrong. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, uh, emphasis on Pokemon battling. We hold official matches at the central court right here at the entrance and any student can freely utilize this court if it's not otherwise in use. He's only a year older than me. Not even, he's six months older than me. Uh, I think perhaps it's fine if you just leave the tour to me. <laughs> Still, it's really relaxing here with the sea breeze blowing over you. Even when no one is battling, you often see students lazing about the stands. Oh, oh, oh. And there's one other quality of our school that you'll likely find very surprising. Wild Pokemon sometimes terrestrialize here. Really? <laughs> I suppose that's not anything special to someone from Paldea, is it? The terrestrial phenomenon was first discovered in the Paldea region, after all. We've taken things a step further than you and your Terra Orbs. We've developed some neat tech ourselves, something that lets us control the terrestrial phenomenon on our own turf. Oh my god, Jake Ost. <laughs> I bet that piques your interest, doesn't it? What if I said no? <laughs> okay, it would get to the lower level. Could you put a little pin in that thought? Okay, come on. I thought we said there was less dialogue in this one, huh? Okay. Univa's region, fame, gym leaders. Wait. Who is it? Who is a Unova gym leader? Lacey? I'm sorry, there's no negotiating with doc director Cyrano once he gets an idea in his head. There's no way that he'll move on with the tour unless we've given him his battle. Besides, I have to admit I'm a little excited myself at the chance to battle you. We tend to go for double battles. Let's give one a try to get... Uh, I can't fucking read anymore. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> I don't know who's in my party. I don't even know. <laughs> Is she from black and white? Well, my Gyarados might be fucked. <laughs> Okay, 70. Okay, Meowskarada. Um, it doesn't matter. Battle. Maybe I could earthquake them. I don't know. Uh, I doubt they're gonna fix the cross eye thing. <laughs> I feel like that's just a personal thing that I'm gonna complain about. Nice. Is she done? Looks like my plus minus strategy isn't working. Uh oh. Oh my god, she's got more Pokemon. Excadrill. Why would she only have three Pokemon if they do doubles? They'll complain about anything, and with how popular Pokemon is, they'll see the issue and respond in so <laughs> Are other people complaining about his eyes? <laughs> you beat me soundly. Okay, well I'm excited to get more money in this game. I actually don't have a lot of money. <laughs> Okay, the students at Blueberry Academy were only recently issued Terra Orbs, so I hope you'll be able to teach us more about them. 
Well done, the both of you. You really battled out it, it out blueberry style. <laughs> oh my gosh, wait, do I get cool clothes? Please tell me I get cool clothes. They're not ugly. I guess it's fine. It kind of looks like Sailor Moon. Style card. Okay. Terrarium. Let's go. I want to go. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> That's insane. Ah, did your character just change clothes right in front of them? <laughs> oh my god. This is kind of cool. I feel like I'm in a zoo, kind of. Okay, that's kind of crazy to build this underwater. I mean, really, like, why build it underwater? I really hope they get into why they built it underwater. This is it. The park beneath the seas. The sea that has gained renown uh, around the world. Our very own terrarium. It may be underwater, but the projectors built into the walls and ceiling make it feel like we're actually outside, don't they? Okay. 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 So it's not like they made a real sun. We're like in a Hunger Games dome. I designed all this myself, and believe me, it wasn't cheap. <laughs> and imagine building underwater is not cheap. <laughs> <laughs> With this dome, there are four distinct biomes. We have the nice, nice and toasty subtropical savanna biome. Then off to your right, you can see the breezy tropical coastal biome. Further to your left, you can see the craggy, crunchy, rugged canyon biome. I like the waterfalls. But last but not least, way out in the distance, we have the arctic and snowy polar biome. It's regulated with the utmost care. That's why you can find completely different Pokemon species living in each area. We sure put a lot of effort into it. Tell me, which biome tickles your fancy off the bat? Mmm, I would say the coastal beach. It seems that you and I will get along just great then. That's my favorite too. The breezy atmosphere is just so calming. If you need to heal up your team, oh my god. This just reminds me of The Sims. <laughs> like, there's like light blocks you could put in your house in The Sims, and it looks just like this. If you need to heal up your team while you're down here, feel free to use the self serve healing. Okay. Can you ex explain to us why crystals form here and how the wild Pokemon are able to terrestrialize? Uh, but don't you already know, don't you know already, Lacey, that, oh, I get it, you want me to do the talking, oh my god. <laughs> In that case, let me show you. The reason is actually right above our heads. That there is the terrarium core, which presides over all that happens in the terrarium. It contains a fluid that we've jam-packed full of special material from Paldea. It's constantly emitting terrestrial energy. That's what allows Pokemon to terrestrialize in the dome. Wonderful. Well said, sir. That's exactly right. I don't know what the special materia material is within the terrarium core itself. It's never been shared publicly, has it? Oh, ho, ho. You want to know? Well, in fact, it's... It's... Now, what is it? I've plumb forgotten. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, so he's not certain. That's fine. That's what I thought you might say. 
Bing bong. Practical battle class will commence shortly in the coastal biome. Students participating in this class should make their way to the coastal biome now. Bing bong. I love saying bing bong. Oh, it looks like you're just in time to see a class session too. This is a good chance, too good of a chance to pass up. Won't you join us? You can get your first taste of our school classes. Oh my gosh, you know, I never even finished school in the base game. I did like one class, that's it. I do love to see that sort of passion for education. Okay, we got the Terraria map on my phone. You like hostess ding-dongs? I'm more of a zinger girl. It's kind of cool, Red Shade. Like, I, I completed one of the classes, and I feel like they give you pretty, like, decent amount of knowledge, and you actually, like, take a little test. It's kind of cute, but... And then I think they give you stuff after you finish the midterms and the tests and shit. Blueberry Pokedex! Catch as many Pokemon here in the terrarium as you please. Don't be afraid to go saws buck wild. <sighs> That's actually kind of funny. Yeah, I think it's kind of fun, Jay Ghost. Is your student life here at Blueberry Academy, so remember to live it up to the fullest. <laughs> non GED have a Pokemon players. <laughs> oh my gosh, Backtrain, so did you complete school? You're an educated woman or what? <laughs> It was only midterms and you weren't done yet and you didn't do the second half. <laughs> There's like seven classes, like seven like sessions you have to go to. In video games? Yes. In real life? Never. <laughs> you completed the school and the extra stuff. Oh, apologies for the ad. I've been like thinking about ads. I don't know if it's worth it. I feel like it's just like, it just disrupts people's experience. More so than like what I make. You know what I mean? I don't know. But I only enabled it since I think the beginning of this week, perhaps. I don't know how to do anything. Oh my gosh, Red Shade. <laughs> so sweet of you. So sweet of you. <laughs> no more ads. Yep, for the next 30 days. <laughs> Are you saying about the ads or are you still on the topic about classes? <laughs> oh yeah, I do like the little side quests that you get like with the, the professors and stuff. It's really cool. Oh, why not both? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't have the user experience. So I tried to just enable it for like a basic ask. I can't believe it's a little zebra guy. This is the only Pokemon I know from black, black and white. And it's funny cause he's literally black and white. Are you from the perfect region? Are you from the perfect region? Yeah. <laughs> oh, we know, we know you're back, Jagos. We all saw it. <laughs> Okay, I'm just dicking around now. I didn't know. I don't know how to do this. Oh my god, they're water fountains for your Pokemon. Drink? 
Pokeballs? <gasps> it's a mart in a vending machine. We have zero quick balls? Okay, I'm gonna buy as many as I can. Ah, oh, shit. I'm just kidding. Um, I'm gonna buy 50. No, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna buy 50. Oops. Do you really? Can I press down on the button? On the D-pad? Shit, my phone came up. <laughs> Buy 10 at a time. Oh yeah, the balls, sorry. I'm, you know, I'm on one today. Okay, here's the thing, is I didn't know if Bactrian's ready. And also, I don't know how to fucking start a lobby without a Pokemon Center. <laughs> so I have no idea how to... Oh, maybe I talked to this fucking loser guy. Heal him up. Okay, never mind. Okay, you're eating. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll have to figure it out. Oh shit. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Idiot. Let's try to catch him with a Pokeball. I can't believe there's so many more Pokemon. Ah oh, shit, I didn't catch it. Embarrassing. Huh, well, I'm gonna definitely kill it. I'll just run. Maybe if I go to class. God, I'm just so excited. Like, look at all these Pokemon. How am I supposed to go to class? How do they expect people to go to class? You can do it from the Poke Portal. Ah, fuck. He said, have a Saws Buck Wild time. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan Horn. Pokey Portal. I don't know the controls in this fucking game anymore. Ah, is why can't I be playing Lego Fortnite? <laughs> okay, so it's here. Okay, the Union Circle, huh? Okay. Okay. So just let me know when you're ready, Bactrian. I'm gonna look for some shiny Pokemon right now. I don't feel like doing my homework, honestly. Huge mood. Amazing. Amazing. This music's kind of fun too. Also, hi Wiz. I, I'm sorry, I like read your message and I'm just like, yes, Pokemon Portal. <laughs> ah! It's like it's like giving old Pokemon vibes. Oh, you know, fuck premiere balls. Honestly, I feel like they have a worse catch rate than Pokeballs. I never use them. I used to do that little, not even like hack, but I would buy in increments of 10 because I was like, okay, I get an extra ball with this, but I never use Premier Balls. They're ugly too. What are these? Like, if not a house to dance in. You know what I mean? Like, this is just a party house. What are these? Bugs? i never seen this Pokemon in my life. <laughs> this is Gen 3. <laughs> Here, I'm, I'll try to make a, a quick ball. Flygon? And he goes, trap, trap inch. This guy. Trap inch. Thank you, Delia. Also, hello. Are you going to be playing this at any point? This is from Gen 3, though, right? Yay. Thanks for the lurks. <laughs> I appreciate it. I hope you're doing well. Okay, I don't I don't need more than one of you. Thank you. Bye. 
I can't wait to get some cool maneuvers. What's this? Ew, it's another one of those guys. Dude, can you imagine living in the Pokemon world and then just seeing giant ass bugs like everywhere? I would cry. Okay, no worries, Delia. If you do play, I hope you enjoy it. Burb. Crocodile. There's so many. So many little dudes. I love them all. This is just... What is this? Never seen this before in my life. What the fuck? Have I seen this in my life? I must have. Must have. Is this the evolved form of the of the guy in the desert? Oh shit. I'm trying to look at. Is the black Taurus a different? He's just a different form. Like a, like a, not like a lowland, but you know, like a different regional typing, right? Jay Kasai, hello, hello. <laughs> this is Cantonese Taurus. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'm just gonna run away, fuck it. No, I don't think they do. Because this one, like, next to his name, it says I haven't caught it yet. Who the fuck's that? Oh, this is the dung beetle. Oh, my God. Do you remember it the other day? <laughs> I just uploaded the VOD onto my YouTube channel. I don't know which stream it was, but I think it was, like, the last Pokemon stream that I did or something. But <laughs> do you guys remember the stream where <laughs> I called... <laughs> Mr. Doctor a Machop and he got super mad at me and then he said that I'm just all legs and he said that I'm a giraffe rig ass Pokemon and he was making fun of me it was so fucking funny what is that what the fuck is that oh I thought the tree was sparkly I thought it was the that long neck. Wow. I'm just chilling on this. This is fun. Yes, siree. I'm having a blast on these blocks. Okay, where is the class? You just finished the DLC today? Very cool. I have just barely started checking it out. I got notified that it came out last night, but I was like, I'm gonna save it for today and play it on stream. But I hope you had a good time with it. These benches. I mean, I, if, if I could, I would talk to you a lot too, Bactrian. What's up? Are they making noises you don't like? My dog's whining. Aww. <laughs> Back to you and I had an idea. But maybe I should DM you in in, in my fear of being publicly rejected. <laughs> Oh my god. Does it involve us talking about things forever? <laughs> Pick a pack. Ew, why am I on Premiere Ball? I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> but yeah, kind of. I wanted to see if maybe you wanted to play games with me. <laughs> I don't know, I just wanted like a chaotic friend to play games with. And you just make you laugh. <laughs> you. Uh... 
but literally no pressure. <laughs> <laughs> I am curious. I like feel it. I feel it through your chats. Where the fuck is the class? What kind of school is this? They just don't, they have such informal classes. Like seriously, am I supposed to know where I'm supposed to go right now? This snubble is just on the table. This is chaos. <laughs> this would be you in the Pokemon world. Just a little snubble standing on the table. I am fucking lost. <laughs> okay. If you were a classroom setting, where would you be? <laughs> I am just getting so distracted by everything. I know this guy. I know this one. No, I don't. I didn't know he had a tail like that. I've never seen this Pokemon. Does he have a pre-evolution? Meowstic. Okay, never seen this Pokemon in my life. <laughs> I thought this was like, do you know the one Pokemon that has the crazy big eyes? That's what I thought this was. Esper. Oh, I'm right. Esper. Yeah, that was the Pokemon I was thinking about. He has an evolution. Okay, are a lot of these Pokemon from black and white? Wow, I'm learning a lot today. Meow stick. Oh, a girl evolution and a boy evolution. Okay. What the fuck's that? Oh, that's a person. <laughs> I thought her hair was a Pokemon. Okay, there's supposed to be a class around here. Wait, is this the Goyle? Is it the Goyle? I need to catch the Goyle. Oh, you fucker. Okay. Um, technically, this terrarium school is the Unova region. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, they keep saying Unova. They said something about the gym leader. Um, I thought they said a Unova gym leader. I don't know, I skipped some dialogue. <laughs> Oops. He's the sadness guy. Oh. No no wonder I kept seeing a triangle on his face. <laughs> They're from Gen 6, and Gen 6 is... Sun and Moon. No? Fuck you. Sorry. <laughs> okay, maybe I can check my map. Oh, you know, I'm in... Oh, I'm barely in the fucking region. Oh my god, it's so big, actually. Oh my... Why did I... I thought, like, this was the entire region. I swear to god. I thought it was just that. Okay. X and Y. Okay, no wonder I don't know anything. I need to play X and Y again. This music is very intense. <laughs> okay. It's very pretty. Look at these flowers. What is that? Like, this looks right. <clears throat> Chris, hi! Hello, hello, hello. How are you? Whisper, whisper. You didn't have any trouble finding the place. 
please. Whisper, whisper. Whisper, whisper. Say again. I didn't quite catch that. Can you hear me when I'm whispering? <clears throat> I think that they, um... I thought that the next one in line was black and white. <laughs> Hey, we're just about to open it up. Let me take my first ever class in the coastal biome. I'm sure you're all enjoying the tropical climb we've recreated here at the coastal biome. Is that what we're calling it? Climb change? But remember, it's really for the many Pokemon you'll find living here adapted for such weather. One such species has even grown exceptionally larger than it might in other regions thanks to all the light it's exposed to here. That's right, certain species of Pokemon can have completely different appearances depending on the region. We call this variation the regional form. And that brings us to today's task. I'd like each of you to catch one of these Pokemon, specifically an Alolan form Pokemon. When you've got one, come and report to me. Now, get catching. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> um, God. Um, I mean, actually gone to school? Huh. Oh, I graduated in 2017. Literally like days from now, probably on this day. How many years is that? I can't do math. I've been out of school for too long. I think the girl in the pink mentions her mom is a gym leader. Oh, Delia, thank you. Thank you for saying that because I fucking accidentally spammed A through some of their conversation. And I was like, I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> Honestly, I would love to do an ASMR stream sometime. So off you go, don't overthink it, and just do your best for this first class. How long have I been to school in Pell Deck? <laughs> no, um, I don't know, since the game came out. Well, maybe her mom doesn't look like her. Okay, I'm I'm gonna have a hard time with this task because I don't know shit. <laughs> Imagine having your username based on Pokemans and then not knowing anything. Are they all different colors or is this different? I don't know. That question made no sense. Alolan. So true, Delia. Oh, here's one. I know this guy. I know this one. I know. Okay, let me just do this. Oh. How do we know what? Hair color is sometimes a recessive gene. Maybe she was adopted. I mean, who are we to judge? Maybe she's just a... <laughs> um, a fucking liar. <laughs> she's just trying to seem super cool in front of me, who's obviously... Super cool. Exchange student, you know. <clears throat> I know, where is our dad in any game? Here, I'm gonna just try to escape and then re-encounter and try to do another 
quick ball. Look at the little thing on his tail. That's silly. What the fuck, Frisk? Does this work if you just uh, leave and then re-encounter? <laughs> Elite Four member. What type of Pokemon would it be? Would it be... Fairy Pokemon? <laughs> Maybe only vagina looking Pokemon. Cloyster. Nice. Only cat Pokemon? Wait, shit, do I need it in my... Maybe not. Number four. I guess it's not surprising that he'd be one of like, the first ones discovered, long ass head. Okay. Oh my god. Um, excuse me, I have a Pokemon. Oh god. Wait. <laughs> He's scared of it. They say that as Executor grew taller and taller, it outgrew its reliance on physical abilities and the power of the sleeping dragon within it awoke. You already finished the assignment? It was a walk in the park. <clears throat> so battling isn't your only talent then. You've got a knack for catching Pokemon too. It's easy to see how high level the students must be at Naranja Academy. <laughs> They're calling psychic Pokemon short kids. <laughs> We're out of time for today. <laughs> that'll have to be it for this class session. If you didn't manage to catch a Pokemon in time, that'll be your homework to complete before our next session. I'm loving the little Sailor Moon outfits. Yes, I'm stuck with homework. What did you think of your first Blueberry class? It was fun. So fun. Really, it makes me so happy to hear that. I was supposed to go make an appearance at the club room. Fuck. <laughs> it's that saying shoot. What's happening? Um, well, we've been debating whether or not Lacey is the offspring of a gym leader because she said she is, and we're kind of calling her on her bullshit right now. So, either she's like a pathological liar, or we can't pin down who her gym leader, trainer, parents are. Here at Blueberry, we have lots of extracurricular tasks you can do called Blueberry Quests, or just barbecues for short. <laughs> They're sort of like missions that the school assigns the students out and about in the terrarium. You might be asked to have your Pokemon do some auto bat battles or to catch specific Pokemon, those sort of things. Okay, this is fun. This is what should have been in the regular game. Blu-ray points. It's a currency you can use in the cafeteria at the school store. So you get paid in blueberries and then you just bring your blueberries to the cafeteria lunch lady. <laughs> You might be able to use it for club activities in the future, too. Anyway, the long and the short of it is that you could do barbecues and get yourself barbecue points. Okay. You can check the quest. Uh, which quests are currently available? You press on the right button when you're out and about. A max of three quests will be displayed by default. Each time you complete a quest, a new one will be added to take its place. Every time you clear 10 quests, a special bonus quest will be unlocked. 
You can also help your friends with their quests. Oh my gosh, you guys, we can do quests together right now. If you're playing together in the Union Circle, once a quest is completed, everyone who took part will receive the battle point, blueberry point, barbecue point reward for that quest. So work together to clear as many as you can. Okay, that's fun. <sighs> These are the blueberries from Hunger Games. Yes, we're actually in a Hunger Game dome right now. Blueberry points, BP, are points you can use to cash at the Blueberry Academy. Oh my god, school store or the student cafeteria, you can also donate them to support other clubs. Who's paying for the trip? Tax dollars. <laughs> Well, my girl looks vicious. <gasps> I was just gonna say I really miss Carmine. Here she is. Here she is. This is Marissa's phone, right? It's me, Carmine. I heard the news. You got picked for Blueberry Academy's exchange program, right? Yes. Dude, we're in love. Huh. One of my old teachers told me, never thought we'd be fellow students of BB Academy. Just call me BB. Anyway, you should totally come show your face. It's been too long already. Now let me think, where can we meet up? Oh, have you been the to the terrarium? There is a special, uh, I'm making up words. There's a space called the Central Plaza right in the center of the dome. I'll meet you there. Don't keep me waiting if you know what's good for you. I will never go so fast in my entire life. I am so excited to see her. We gotta go. I don't even care if I fly for one second. We're going so as fast as we can. Oh my gosh, Wiz, me too. Carmine was actually super cool near the end. Okay, actually, I don't know where I'm going. Not me going the entirely fucking opposite way. Okay, don't worry, Carmine. I'm on my way. <laughs> I don't think it helps that my face is blocking the camera. Or the, the map. <laughs> don't you worry, Carmine. <laughs> okay, maybe we'll go over here. I think I have to go this way. What is that? Oh, that's a love disc. Ew, it's so ugly. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, I'm trying to... Uh... Okay, we still gotta keep going this way. I'm doing so well on navigating right now. You wouldn't believe. You wouldn't believe! Factory in! Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Frisk. Frisk. Get out of ad. Hell. I can't believe I'm still in the same biome. I'm losing it. Sorry, Wiz. Sorry to everybody with the fucking ads. <laughs> What song? I feel like this is a remix of like a song. Hi Wiz, welcome back. Sorry for the ads, but thank you for watching them. And helping to support the stream for free. Um, Oddish Leaf. Whoa. Oh wait, that's normal. Okay, sorry. I don't know what I'm doing. Hi. <laughs> I think I need to go this way. Do you think these are like the actual blocks that, well, it looks like it, they are. They actually block off the biomes. That's actually kind of crazy. Oh wait, it's so cute. The little song. Okay, that's okay. We're, we're making it. I gotta explore anyway. Wow. I don't know if I'm a fan of this or not. <laughs> 
Oh god. Wait, what the fuck? Where's the door? Okay, I guess I'll go around. Okay, there we go. This is really weird, but cute. Look at this little dugong. Aww. What if we just stared at her forever? <laughs> okay, let me say hi to my girlfriend really quick. So yeah, things are a bit rough right now. I couldn't agree more. I like her little chain thing. She looks like a commander. Also, you have a visitor, Carmine. Long time no see, Marissa. I bet you missed me, huh? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Never clicked. <laughs> Never clicked yes so fast. <laughs> time for me to go. <laughs> She's like, the sexual energy between both of you are too much. I gotta dip. <laughs> what do you mean your girlfriend? You mean our girlfriend. <laughs> Hi, Afro. Oh, uh, Wiz, I said I felt the same way, like 100%. Carmine was really scary at first, but then she turned out to be super cool, and I didn't, I don't think I ever really liked Kieran. I just don't really like goofy kids, you know? <laughs> Delia <laughs> looks respectfully. <laughs> nice seeing you, Carmine, so long. Okay, I'm so excited. That's one of my classmates. She's an interesting one. <laughs> hmm, speaking of classmates, it feels kind of weird seeing you here at my school. And look at you. You haven't changed at all since we last met. As for me, well, I've been helping Miss Briar with her research. We've been to all sorts of different regions. It's made my Pokemon a lot stronger than they were last time we battled. Eh heh heh. You want to see? <laughs> oh, you totally want to see. <laughs> we have a battle court right here, so get into position. I didn't heal my Pokemon, so... And also, I only have like four Pokemon. And a Snorlax. I don't know, I'm kind of nervous. But I'm fine if she kicks my ass, honestly. I can live with that. Belle, hello, hello. So far, so good. It's cool. A doubles team? Can't I just use my regular Pokemon? <laughs> oh, thank you for the hydrate. I think I owe you two. I'm sorry. Thank you. Sir, yes, sir. Okay, I might move my camera. Middle. I feel like I like that a little bit more. I mean, aren't we all? Nimona. I also really like Nimona. I think she's great. Oh, I have random Pokemon on my team now. <laughs> it's crafty. Heating up its beak.
kindness. So she's nice now, huh? Sorry, Scrafty. What happened to the Tukana? Oh, she only has four Pokemon? Oops. <laughs> Tara it up. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god, she's going to kick my ass. This song is good. Meowskarada. You silly little cat. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's try this again. Is everybody's battling capabilities supposed to be good in this game? In this DLC? I feel like this is a pretty good fight. That did not go the way I had planned. Do you think she thinks I'm cool? Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Hello. Oh my god, you smell so bad. My dog is stinky. It's only gonna get harder. Oh, both of my dogs are stinky. I don't know. I think it's just because they went outside and they're just kind of hot. You know how, like, oh shit. Oops, sorry, pick a peck. Stinky. You still don't hold back in battles, huh? Another thing that hasn't changed a bit. Hey, by the way, have you run into Kiki yet? Kiki? Never mind, if you haven't seen him. Oh, that's her brother. <laughs> Does Kiki love you? <clears throat> Are you kidding me? What, was this assignment too hard for you too? Wait, that's <gasps> Kiki. Right, who? I don't know. Oh my god, is that her brother? He almost saw us. <gasps> he looks different! Shh, 
keep your voice down. I thought I told you to train five Pokemon to battle with. Uh, sorry, things have been really hectic at home this month. Oh, got it. Sorry to spoil it, Adelia. <laughs> so that means you're just okay with being this weak forever? That's what I'm hearing? N no, I... Well, since you're so busy, I'll go ahead and do you a favor. I'll write your resignation from the club for you. I don't need people in my club who don't take it seriously. Cabooty. <laughs> Enjoy your lurk. It's only gonna get more spoily from here. Wait, Kieran, I'm sorry. Give me another chance. Wow. Not what you were expecting, right? He looks different, acts different. He hasn't been the same since we got back from the school trip. Well, that was painful to watch. Urk. Is that what his name is? Urk. If it isn't Carmine and Carmine's new girlfriend, Miss Mystery Friend. <laughs> He's entering his villain arc. Yeah, he's just like every girl after a traumatic experience. <laughs> just cut and dye your hair. <laughs> I think I might have heard of you though. Are you that kid with the wild backstory? What a lovely surprise. Just the annoying bozo I didn't want to run into. Come on now, at least introduce me. This is Drayton. Yeah, he looks like a fucking Drayton. <laughs> He's the strongest trainer at Blueberry Academy. Well, he was, at least. Beautiful intro, thanks. This is Marissa, she's here on Foreign Exchange Program. She's my friend and I'm in love with her and... <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean, Afro? Girls notoriously cut, cut and dye their hair. After they're sad. <laughs> what about Kieran? You friends with the guy? That's right. We are we friends? I don't know if we're really friends with him. I'm gonna move my camera back, sorry. All right, Marissa, how about I show you our club room? Huh? Why do you need to do that? You haven't joined any of the clubs we got here, right? Take it from me. You'll have a way better time if you join one. We'd love to have such an interesting new member. In fact, we better call dibs now. Come with me. Hey, hold on. See, I told you he was the worst. Look at him, just assuming we'll go along with whatever. I'm going with you. It's cute, it's kind of like a bee. Boob berry. And here we are. <laughs> hey, are you sure this is a good idea? You know, cause, cause of Kieran, nah, don't worry. He won't show up here anytime soon. If you say so. This is cute. This is the base of the operations for the League Club. On behalf of the whole club, glad you're here. What is the League Club? Yeah, what's the League Club? Oh my god, look at the little whiteboard drawings! It's so cute! <laughs> We Blueberry Academy students have our own Pokemon battle ranking system, the BB League. Here in the League Club, we battle each other to train up so we can climb the ranks. We win, we lose, we have a good old rowdy time, such as our humble club in a nutshell. You're not wrong, but seriously, that's how you explain it to new people? Yep, I guess we're having less of a good old rowdy time than usual lately. Look at the little horsey. 
Gotcha. Connecting the dots. I'm connecting the dots, Avro. I'm a member of the club too. I don't show up to the club room very much though. Just FYI, the top four Pokemon trainers in the BB League are called the BB League Elite Four. <laughs> and this annoying toothpaste haired bozo <laughs> is one of them. So is that girl you saw with me at the terrarium earlier. Too bad you didn't make the cut, Carmine. I've just been too busy with extra, ex extracurricular stuff. Haven't had time for league matches. If we're talking actual skill, I'm way above the Elite Four. <laughs> That's no lie. Toothpaste hair ass. What you think, where's a fun club, huh? Yes, sure. Ooh, I can feel the enthusiasm. That's what I'm talking about. Anyway, I think that takes care of it. Ta you, you know, no words. You're in on a trial basis. What do you mean trial basis? You heard me. As far as the Dracers concerned. Is he calling himself Dracer? Trial basis clubmates. So you can use this club room freely and do whatever with the stuff here. Check out the computer over there. It's super helpful. You use your battle blueberry points to support kids and other clubs will return the favor in different ways. Okay, you can help support the efforts of other clubs by donating blueberry points to them. In return, you'll reap all kinds of rewards, such as new functions on your camera app, new ways to redecorate the club room. Give it a shot and you'll see what I mean. Cute. Try sending that to Mitch on the baseball club. What if I wanted to join the baseball club? Contribute blueberry points. I'm developing new throwing styles. Want cool new ways to throw pokeballs? <gasps> Let's spitball together in return for your contributions to our club's finances. What? What? Wish we could do it in person, but let's try pitching some ideas for new ways to throw. See, see I was thinking I could hold my hand like this. Get me, swing my leg, and hee <laughs> I think that'll work. Talking through this with you really helped. Uh, we've come up with a real home run here. If you ever want to change how you throw your Pokeballs, just give me another call. I feel like this being a Japanese game and them immediately wanting to... <laughs> But the sport of baseball in here is just amazing. <laughs> That'll teach me to doubt your skills. Here, I've got a really nice present for you from one charming catch to another. Catching charm. Having one of these mysterious, unshakable charms makes it more likely for you to get a critical catch. Oh my god, please. I don't want to look like a Dracer. <laughs> Feel free to computer it up any way you want. Like I said, we're trial basis clubmates now. Are those candies? Oh, For limited time, you can have as many of those snacks as you want. I want some snacks. Bye, babe. Thank you so much. Have a good last hour of work. Those snacks are all yours, Drayden. Snacks you leave around open and half finished. I wouldn't go near any of them. Who knows how long they've been sitting around. I want some snacks though. Maybe we can have a cafeteria date to discuss, or uh, to talk details. <gasps> Wait, Carmine's jealous? One of your nicknames for Snickers is Snacks. I love that. <laughs> oh, that bozo. Seriously, what's his problem? A cafeteria date. What does that, what does he even mean by that? Should I tell her what a date is or I should just tell her to calm down? I'm going to tell her what a date is. Maybe she'll want to go on with me. I know what a date is. Were you seriously about to explain it to me? Ugh, sorry. Being in here puts me on edge. Let's go somewhere else. 
Snickerdoodles. Oh my gosh, I love that. I'm um, I'm going to my mom's house on Saturday because she has an annual baking day where we make all of our holiday cookies. And I was like, I'm gonna make some Snickerdoodles. So I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try to make Snickerdoodles from scratch. We'll see how they come out. I never made them before and I'm excited. I am very excited just in general to make cookies, but I wanted to make something a little different this, this time. Yeah, I'm hoping it's good. I'm really hoping it's delicious. Dude, I wanna use this machine. Okay, are we going somewhere else? Oh God, oh my dorm room. I'm taking Carmine to my dorm room? <laughs> you made them with your mom when you were younger. Aw, I love that. Are they like nostalgic tasting to you? <gasps> Those cookies better be good because you just ignored Carmine saying, let's go somewhere more comfortable in your room. Well, it looks like this is your room. Most baby students live in the dorms, you know. So what do you think? How does it compare to your dorm room back at your school? So blue, so new, about the same. I'm gonna say it's so blue. We're at the Blueberry Academy. Of course it's blue. You can come have a look at my room later too if you want. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Hey, yo! Hi, Pyro! <laughs> you came just in time. Um, yeah, I love the peanut butter blossoms. Those are my favorite cookies ever. I could eat like 12 of them in one sitting. I love them. Okay, she needs to tell me something that she's so in love with with me. Okay, it's about Drayden and Will Kiki. About Drayden, about Kieran, about Drayden, about Kieran. Let's ask about Kieran. Kiki is, well, you saw how he is. He's scar scaring me nowadays. Sorry, I thought this was scarring. <laughs> Ever since we got back from Kid Takami, it's like he's become a totally different person. He's been battling and training every day. He's even cutting back on sleep. He's, he's definitely gotten stronger. Drayton used to be the strongest student here, but Kiki beat him. Now Kiki's the president of the league club and the BB League champion. Wow. I guess he must be pretty busy. He barely talks to me anymore. Oh, well. He's probably just going through his rebellious phase. Kieran changed, but you, you've stayed the same. If Kieran's down uh, to just one friend these days, I'm glad it's you. Keep sticking with him, would you? She's just not... She's just not her, his friend. <sighs> Jamie, I'll check in a bit. Thank you. And there's one more thing I need to tell you about. About Drayden? Ugh, Drayden, don't trust that knucklehead. He might seem like a slacker, but don't let him fool you. He's up to something. He's a real super annoying jerk. He barely even goes to class. He has to repeat the same year three times. Point is, don't ever let your guard down around him, ever. If you're going on your date, I mean, you're gonna go hang out with Drayden later, right? I'd go with, but I don't. if I don't finish up this report today, I'm gonna be in trouble. I'd love for you to join the league club, but if Drayden gives you any trouble, don't be afraid to give him a good sucker punch. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I don't wanna leave. The kitchenette and the blueberry dorms have a refined color palette. What if I look at that bed? Want to lie down for a rest? Wait, there's a sky, but I'm underwater? I mean, I know it's fake. If Drayton says anything stupid, just hit him with a second. Okay. Man, I'm sad. I don't want to leave you. Oh my god. Oh my god.
Oh my god, look at this little door chick on the chair! Are you kidding me? Oh my god, is this person gonna battle me? Let me know what you like and I'll dish some right up for you. Oh, I can buy stuff. Academy pizza. Oh, wow. Tour chair. Look at these fries. Oh my God, I am so, I want a snack. Oh, looks so good. If you want to battle the Elite Four, you got to clear the Elite Trials if you want a shot at battling the Elite Four. No way. I can't handle heights. No way I can do Amorous's <laughs> Elite Trial. Give the Torchic a booster seat. <laughs> Wait, oh my gosh, look at these little guys. They're floating. Coastal, Canyon. There's no better place to enjoy a sandwich than the Coastal Biome. Lacey's Plaza. Hmm. Oh, so the Elite Four have their own little areas, huh? Okay, let's talk to this loser. Jamin, I'll check in a second. It's no big deal. No need to stand there. Grab a seat. Here's the Draster take. I... Fucking hate that he's calling himself Drayster. The Academy's special's the best thing on the menu. It's all so soft, you can basically just gulp it down. Barely even need to chew. Wow, that sounds tasty. Chew your food, Drayton. <laughs> huh, you and my ma would get along. So listen, your Pokemon are pretty strong, yeah? With a team like that, you've got a shot at becoming the BB League champion. Wouldn't that be wild? An exchange student just rolling up here and snatching the crown. You want to? I want to see you in the BB League, Marissa. You win. Uh, sure. Uh oh. Look who's decided to grace us with their presence. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, it's all of them. Whoa. It's the champion, and the rest of the elite four too. What did you want to talk to me about? Nothing special, just thought we could grab a bite. Where better to do that than the cafeteria? What a waste of time. If you got so much time to goof off, why don't you go train your Pokemon? You think this is why you always lose to me? Uh, I'll take that as a no. So I can't swing a lunch date with you, even if I, I've got your old pal with me? Huh, Marissa? Should I say you look different? No, I'm gonna say a long time no see. Why? You didn't hear that she was coming to study abroad here? You were cheesing, I know. <laughs> For real? Yes, it's true. Director Cirudo himself introduced her to me when we met at the school's entrance. We're already tight, us two. In fact, I was just asking Marissa to join the BB League. Ooh, I like that. That'd be fire. What? A student from another school joining the BB League? Unprecedented. That's right. Marissa may be wonderfully capable in battle, but that doesn't mean she belongs in the BB League. Come on, do you all hate fun and friendship or something? You want to exclude someone who's taking our same classes and living in our same dorms? How is she not one of us? And if this place is, uh... And isn't this place supposed to be all about students having autonomy? I think we should vote on it. I'm a yes, obviously. How about you, Lacey? I'm sorry, but considering the rules, it's a no from me. What about you, Crispin? Crispin? <laughs> huh? Yeah, why not? She's at her school that makes you a student like us, right? How about you, Amorous? Amorous? What do you say? I abide by the rules of this institution. Proposition declined. Two against two, huh? All right then, what says the reigning BB League champion, our mighty Kieran? Hey, go find somewhere else. It doesn't matter who I'm facing, I don't lose. Huh, guess we got our answer. Wow. Hey. No, no playing in here. Go somewhere else. 
Can you go outside? <sighs> Hold up a sec. My, my dogs are play fighting and they smell and I think they got into stuff. Hello. You're gonna raid my fridge? <laughs> Drayton, manipulating people to get what you want is just not right. I would like to raid my fridge. I could go for a snack. Yes, you'll be joining the BB League, huh? Look on a bright side. Maybe you'll you and Kieran will become out of this better friends. Don't worry, I'll be right behind you every step of the way. But now that decision's been made, we better get you officially signed up. Meet me at the reception desk in the school's entrance area. Whoa. Hit stop. Her room's cute. Look at her little Pokemon. Ah! What if I look at her laptop? Done sparse. I'm gonna decorate my room like this. Okay, this is where you get you signed up. I want to join the BB League. Don't mind that. <laughs> Override the system. I'm not, I don't mean to sound rude, but I'm not sure if I can take what you say at face value, Drayton. <laughs> no, he's telling the truth. I'm allowing Marissa to join the BB League. Yes, champion. One moment, please. Didn't expect you to ride up in shining armor and save the day. I've got a feeling you're trying to play puppet master. But if I get shot a, a shot at battling Marissa, then that's fine with me. Heh <laughs> heh. That's just peachy. Marissa. You better not go losing to anyone until our battle. Like I'd lose. <laughs> Good. I'm not a little kid anymore, and you know it when I show you how the best of the best battle. Hey, crazy maniac guy, what are you doing? My dog is insane right now. Kiki, you shouldn't talk to Marissa like that. Shut it, sis. Ah. Oh. Looking forward to see you climb the ranks. Hmm. I'm sorry, Marissa. Kiki was really acting out, wasn't he? 
That's my first time talking to him in a while, man. Two, man, such an attitude. Well, he's Mr. Big Deal Mighty Champion after all. Drayton, you're the one who dragged Marissa into all this BB League drama, aren't you? Me, no way, this was all her idea. Right, Marissa? What if I say no? No. <laughs> No doubt about it. Hear that, Carmine? She's hungry for action. <laughs> I don't know. I think something fishy is going on. But, well, if you're going to do this, you might as well do your best. I'll be cheering for you. And please, keep an eye on Kiki for me. This man's crazy. Thank you for waiting. Your entry is complete. Okay, I'm cleared. Great. Usually you'd start by battling regular students and climbing the ranks, but seeing as how you've got recommendations from several Elite Four members and director Serrano, you'll start from a higher rank. You'll skip straight to challenging the Elite Four in their respective bases in the Terrarium. Once you clear their trials, that is. Go, I'll go ahead and mark their locations on your Rotom phone now. Crazy. Wow. I'm excited. Anytime you want to battle one of us, you'll have to do a fun little trial we cook up first. Sound good? Catch you in the terrarium, bud. Yes, finally, Union Circle time. Back train, are you ready? Oh shit. I'm not online. Sure. <laughs> Okay, it looks like the mystery gets right here. I have just reached the Savannah biome. Is that okay? You should be able to complete everything else, like when we join the party, if that makes sense. No, you could do, you could be wherever you want. Okay, how the fuck do I do that? How do, how do I do this? Information. Okay, I guess that's not going to do anything for me. Right? Is this what I'm supposed to do? Or internet? It's a bop. Okay. Here's the code. How's everyone day today? You beat the DLCs, so you're doing good. Is this you, Bacterian? It's a me. Okay. What do I need to do? Set out together. 
Dude, I can't believe we all have the same game. I know. <laughs> Can we get a full Scarlet team? It's kind of crazy. I feel like a lot of people got Scarlet rather than Violet. There's always one. Yo, where the fuck are we? Ah! If you complete three bonus quests while playing together using Union Circle, you will uh, start to receive special group quests that you can all take on together. You can check the details of any group quest by uh, you receive by selecting them in the quest list. Okay, I got it. So smart, I got it. Okay, here's here's our tasks, right? Marissa, Frisk Gloves. Oh, you don't have any Yep Yak Train because I don't think you went to that part, but that's okay. It's totally fine. Where are we though? Like, how do we? Don't shouldn't we go to like the other map? You know what I mean? Can we do that? Possible? Is it possible to do this? I think I'm just gonna, um, <laughs> I'm just gonna go back here. <laughs> I love the plane sound effect. What is this? Sweet, sweet synchronization. The euphoria of synchronization. Oh, hello there. My name is Sinclair. I'm quite the outstanding researcher. Wow, humble. Would you like to help me out by participating in an amazing experiment I'm working on? Sure. That's the spirit. Let's head over to the test area then. You'll need to have a Pokemon out of its ball for this experiment. Just let me know when you're ready. Where the fuck did my Pokemon go? There we go. Right? That's it. Are you ready to help me out with this amazing experiment? Sure. I'm a little nervous. I don't know what the fuck I walked into. <gasps> What? Now that you're all synced up, your Pokemon will move as directed by your thoughts. Let's start with a movement test. There's a tree in front of the, your Pokemon. Try moving over there. Oh my god. This is insane. I am the Meow. You're so in sync. I was able to get some very useful data from that session. Thank you so much. <laughs> Here's a little something for your trouble. Oh man, I wanted blueberry points. Yes, give me blueberry points afterwards. Yes, I am so in the mood. Oh. Your mind and feelings are synchronized with those of your Pokemon once again. Since this is your second time synchronizing, you should be able to do all sorts of things. So let's begin the battle test. Try taking on some of the other Pokemon in the area. This is fucked. This is just a real life fight club. Just become a Pokemon and smack the shit out of everybody else. Okay, I guess we're gonna try to fight. Look at these guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> and you can collect stuff. This is my favorite thing ever. Dude. <laughs> what if I just talk to this person? Hello. I am Pokemon. <laughs> what if I smack the shit out of this guy? <laughs> I 
What's this? With a little tie rope. This is so cool. You've got the best synchronization I've ever seen. Thank you. Synchro machine. Okay. You can work in sync with Pokemon that you have walking around with you. Hold the L button and then press the R button to begin synchronizing. Just remember that the Synchro Machine only works in the Terrarium. Okay. Look at that. You can be a little seal. <laughs> you kidding me? Oh my gosh. What's with that guy? He looks so cool. Is he a shiny? Who's that? Oh, is it somebody? Oh my god. Who is that? <laughs> Frisk, is that you? <laughs> that is so crazy. Amazing. Amazing. This person just asleep. That's so crazy. Interesting. We're gone. Wait, is it real? Oh, it's on like a bird stand. But it doesn't need a bird stand. He's floating. <laughs> this is silly. Wait a sec. Do those blocks come in different colors for the different biomes? I'm top form. I'm in top form. Wow. This is cool. Okay. Sure, I'll see something cool. Wait, oh, I thought I was supposed to follow you. Where'd you go? Oh, you're doing the cool glide thing. Ah, uh, I haven't finished everything. I can't do it, I'm so sad. I don't want to look. I don't want to look at how cool you are. I don't care if it's the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Are you a grimer? Ew! I wanted to explore. I never go the right way. Never ever go the right way. I think this game is really fun. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to go in here. Oh my gosh. Me? Okay, oh, can, can he not travel? Wow, this is where I was with my Pokemon, huh? It's interesting. <laughs> okay, I wanted to go to one of the... Oh, well, I wanted to go here to this little outbreak. And you know what? 
I am yet again not in the right spot. <laughs> That's okay, I'll get to it. Make yourself a TM. There's a cave! This is really interesting. <laughs> Kind of weird. Oh shit. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm working so hard to get out this mountain and then I bounce off of a Pokemon at the top and then it just fell. Oh my god. That was so goofy. God. Who's there? Hello? Okay, I wanted to make it to the outbreak, so I just need to go south. Which I think is this way. But yeah, it should be right here. What is it? Milkry? I don't really know what a Milkry is. Good job. Oh my gosh, did you just murder that guy? Cute! <laughs> Even our Pokemon are in sync! I'm gonna go to some of these. I wanna know why this is here. Why is this here? It looks like Tetris. What do? Oh. Okay, I need to do some quests, huh? Defeat? Oh shit. Easy. Let's kill him. We're gonna do so many quests. What did I do? No, I didn't want to do that. Oh my god. Take a photo of a wild Pokemon that's swimming. Oh man, I'm so mad. Travel over 500 yards. Okay. I can do that. So easy. So easy. Just go for a little run.
These are spooky trees. What was that? Sneak up on a Pokemon? Wow. I guess I need to travel to some water, huh? Maybe that's not deep enough for them to be swimming. What the hell is this? Water? There's something swimming. How do you pull out your camera? There we go. Okay, how do I zoom in? I don't want to share it. <laughs> we are doing so good. Absolutely killing these. I did, yes. I played I played the old one. <sighs> like as an adult. The very old one, but then I, I did get the, the new one and it was fun. Pick items up on the ground ten times. I can do that so well. You just watch. <laughs> My favorite thing to do. <laughs> this counts, right? Yeah, it does. Hi, Chai. Thursday vibes. I need to sneak up on a Pokemon, I guess. Okay, how can I... Oh, shit. Does that count? Or was it alerted before me? I'll try to kill it just to see. The returning legendaries are shiny locked. Hmm. Oh, uh, okay. I shall try that. Like that? I feel like that didn't count either. I like the little quests though. I really wish that they had added something like this in the base game. How far have you played in the DLC, Chai? Me too. I also like that. I 
You found me. Wait. How was that complete? Oh my god, I don't think I'm... Uh, I don't think that was for the right... Catch one Pokemon. Maybe I don't have that task anymore. Defeat 10 wild Pokemon using auto battle. Okay, I can do that. You still had to finish the other DLC? Yeah, I basically just got through the main intro part right now and now I'm just fucking around. <laughs> but we opened like a union circle. So we're just hanging out. Simply Crucio. Hello, hello, welcome to the channel. I'm enjoying it. I feel like it has a lot of um, like fun, fun little mechanics with this little side quest thing for the club. I think it's really cool. I wish that something like this was in the base part of the game, but honestly, I feel like just generally speaking, I don't have a lot of performance issues with the game. So, I don't know. And then I tell other people that like, my one of my favorite games is Skyrim. So like, who am I to fucking complain about Pokemon? You know what I mean? Am I doing anything? I feel like my things change so quickly. Pick up 10 items on the ground. Okay, I can. Wait. Do we, are we all doing these together? Even if it says not my name? Okay. Okay, that makes sense. Cause I was like, I definitely have not battled <laughs> 10 Pokemon. Hell yeah, it'll be so fun. Then we'll get even more quests to complete. In an onion circle. <laughs> yes, I feel like this is and should be why you wanna play online with people, you know? So if I complete this one, it will, it'll complete it twice? For both of us? Interesting. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. What's your thing? Is it a spoiler? You could tell me. Make yourself a TM. Okay, so let's travel. Hmm. Yeah, tell me. I'm curious. Literally three more yards. We, did we get the goal? We're one, one task away. Catch one Pokemon. Here, do I need to catch a Venona? No, I don't. There's a food item in the cafeteria you can buy and it gives you sparkling power for all Pokemon. <gasps> Ooh. 
Hell yeah. I like that. <laughs> I fucking hate making sandwiches, dude. It's so hard and scary because if you don't get it right, then you fuck everything up. Oh, it's only sparkling one? Do you think it's worth it then? Would it just like double the shiny charm then? Have you been using it? Like, do you think it's effective? Where are we at with this? I was trying to catch one Pokemon. Well, you know what? I'm just gonna defeat them. I don't like catching Pokemon. <laughs> Wow, five different shinies in 30 minutes. That's a good deal. That's a good grab. Okay, so what do we got? What's this? Battle a wild Terra Pokemon. Okay, let's try to find one. Hmm. I like the little nests. My game! My game! Okay, I need to find like a... I need to find a shiny... Pokemon thingy to battle. There's one in this game. What the hell is that? Oh, that's a dingus. Dung. Poopy guy. I hate when you're like looking for something and then it's just the one thing that doesn't happen ever. <laughs> Why? Why is that a thing that happens? That's a cool rock. These little Tetris pieces everywhere are interesting. <laughs> this one's 
Oh, this is where I... I'm by the entrance. Okay. I'm learning. I'm learning where I am. Here's the thing. I can battle this one. Let's see. Do I still have it up? Oh. No, it's not even up anymore. <laughs> I'm looking for something that doesn't even matter. Okay, fun. Maybe I can make a TM. Right? Would there be a TM machine here? Maybe not. This heals. Can I do it? Can I do it? I love that that picking up items on the ground is now a quest. <laughs> My favorite shit to do. In love, I'm obsessed. don't know what to do you just want to dance up to now you only had access to entry level stuff now seeing how you handled that i think we can give you ask access to regular quests keeps up the good work would ya oh my god it's cool we're gonna get new quests Look at that, you caught it. Now you can dance with it. Now you can be the Oriko Corio Ori Corio. <laughs> and you can dance. You can run around and dance as the Pokemon. Oh shit. Who are you? What are you doing in that bush? What are you doing? Can you, like, fast travel to... Oh, is this the entrance? Oh, it is, huh? I want to go exchange my points. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Music club. Smart speaker for the club room. 
change the look of the club room. Update feature for the lock-on feature. That's cute. I want to do like a bunch of little things. Oh shit! <laughs> I look so cool. Oh no, I'm left-handed? Uh-oh. Oh, it's change. Oh, it's just change your style. Okay. Let's do an item printer. Fuck it. Yes. Hi. This is the science club. Wow. This is the first time we ever got a donation. Let me hurry right over there to that item printer for you. <laughs> I'm excited for this. Item Roger, I'm a member of the Science Club, but we developed this device. I'll be right here to help you use it if it's not too much trouble to have me in your club room. What is the item printer? If you put materials dropped by Pokemon into this printer along with some blueberry points, you'll be able to get items in exchange. Okay. The exact inner workings are our little secret. We're in the midst of applying for a patent. But all you need to know is it takes materials and lets you print items. It's fantastic. Sure. I want to make it better. What do you mean? Okay. Crazy. Yeah, I want to print something. What? Let's try it, you know? This is weird. Can I do it with this? This is weird. Turn handle. It's a little sparkle. Oh my gosh, are there recipes? Dude, I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> but it's kind of cool. Look at this one's a golden sparkle. A metal coat. I wonder if I make the same thing, it'll make the same thing. I want to test it. I think it's different. Ooh. Okay, this is kind of sick. I'm just gonna make a shit ton of Psyduck stuff. <laughs> I have so much. Oh my gosh, you know what? I should I should make like more than one at a time. How about I make 10? Look at that. Oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. I could just use my the items I have a lot of stuff for.
I'm gonna make what ten items. This is crazy. Ah! It's all sparkly. Wow. That's pretty sick. This is cool. I wonder if I can make improvements. Can I make improvements? Please, please let me make it better. Okay, I can't yet. I am, I was printing items. This is really fun. I like it. Okay, I wanna keep doing points. Terrastalized. You. Oh, there's even more. That's crazy. Wow, fan fancy and dark. Wow. I want that. Smart speaker. Maybe we should get a smart speaker. I like how he speaks with music notes. <laughs> this is the future, brisk. <laughs> Nothing better than blasting some bops. Oh. Yeah, check the Academy Life album. Oh, I see. Get some more music. Get the comedy album. <gasps> Sick. Town tunes. You're gonna start speaking with music notes. <laughs> Only if you're in the music club. I mean, I want to see what sounds. I want. Check the town tunes. Wow. Wow. I can't fucking hear anything. Wow, those are the worst ones. This one's fine. I like this. Okay, I wanna make the room cool. We gotta do it for the art club. Filbert. We need help from Filbert. Okay, I think I might call it for today, but I will be live again tomorrow. And that's it. I was gonna say I can stream for longer, but I can't. Cause we're gonna see a movie. So.
Thank you for being here, Red Shade. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the gifted sub today. <laughs> You're welcome, Frisk. Yeah, I, I would love to play with you guys again tomorrow if you want. I like doing the little quests. And it seems like it's pretty beneficial to play online when we're doing that. So I think that's pretty sick. No pressure at all, Bagtree. <laughs> I like, I haven't played Pokemon in a long time. So literally since I last streamed it. So, but maybe I will like get on uh, offline. I don't know, we'll see. But like no, no pressure to do literally anything. <laughs> Uh, but thank you all for hanging out today. I really do appreciate it. I'll see you all tomorrow. Hopefully. I think we'll raid Chai. Looks like he just got online. I think. Yeah, literally six minutes ago. Okay, perfect. No, you're lovely. It was only lovely because you decided to say yes to playing games with me and you indeed played a game with me today. So that's it. It's going to be a back to stream from now on and only good days when you're here. <laughs> no, but thank you. I, I appreciate it and I hope we can play more games in the future. Okay, let's... I will always say yes to the dress. <laughs> I love your brain. Okay. We'll start the raid for Chai. We love Chai, so give him some love. I think he's shiny hunting the starters or something. Seems like. And I will see you guys tomorrow. So have a lovely evening. Stay hydrated. I need to drink more water right now before I go to physical therapy and they kick my ass again. Um, yeah, tomorrow's Friday. So I hope you feel good about having a Friday. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. 